Hey guys, Reno Bones back again with another toy unboxing and review. Today I've got BAM, Beasts, uh, Aliens, and Mechs. This is Saber Jaws. Picked this thing up at Big Lots. It was on sale and it was the only one they had in stock. And I've never seen anything quite like it. Obviously, Saber Jaws here is a werewolf and he's pretty big. Let's open this thing up and take a look. Oh my gosh, he is just covered with all these little stretchy, holdy down bands. Let's see if I can just pop them. So rubbery. Got some tape on his mouth, I guess, so he doesn't talk. I'm gonna have to get the knife. My gosh, that is some stout rubber. Oh, there's one in the middle. All right, here we go. We got Saber Jaws. He is made of 100% plastic. He's got little bits of tape covering up his wounds here. It's kind of strange, just little bits of tape everywhere. Wonder why that is. All right, no other tape. So yeah, made out of uh, plastic. He does have kind of rubbery hands here, uh, feet, totally plastic. I love how big they are. This thing is definitely gonna stand up easily does have a little bit of toe articulation in that they uh, rotate, just like toes are want to do. Uh, we do have elbow and we've got shoulder. We do have wrist articulation as well. You can get some pretty nice looking poses. Head actually turns quite a bit. Doesn't look like the mouth does much at all. It looks like it should close. Take a look at that. It's definitely jointed there, but the mouth doesn't close or anything. Um, yeah, that's okay. He wiggles his head. There is no waist articulation, but he does have hip. And that's about it. Hip and foot. So no knee articulation there, so you're not going to get any real powerful werewolf stances. But that's okay. Check this guy out. The paint application is not bad. Um, definitely some airbrushing going on on his belly. You can see that some of the paint here is probably going to be scraping off. Decent wounds here, a little bit of trash stuck to him. We've got some chains on the wrist. Uh, that's the only chain. Gosh, the wounds look really good. This is very um, cartoony, but it just looks pretty cool. Honestly, looking at the face here, I think I like the milky white eye a lot better. I'm probably gonna go with and with some acrylics and I'm gonna repaint that eye to be white as well. I know that this eye is just damaged because of the uh, little wound that goes across it, but it looks cooler, and I like cool stuff. So, yeah, check him out. Get him up under the cool camera here. Look at that. Not, not me. Look at him. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. That is neat. For a cheapo toy that you can get at Big Lots, Obviously, it was the last one, so you might not be able to get it at your big lots. I'll probably never find another one of these guys again. That is stinking awesome. I absolutely love this. Uh, of course, he does have screw holes in the back, um, as cheap toys often do. But the posability is there. This has lots of different movements, lots of articulation, and he's a lot better than I expected. I'm going to have this guy kind of towering up over me probably up on one of my high shelves there because I want this one to be seen when people walk into my room. I really like him. That is so cool. He actually reminds me a lot of Man Bat, uh, one of the characters from Batman, obviously. And obviously he doesn't have wings, but you can definitely see that they took a few styling cues from Man Bat. Very similar body structure. That is pretty. That's really nice. I like this. You guys like this? You can't have this. This is mine. This is my Saber Jaws. That's not going to be his name for long. Um, leave a comment down in the comment section and tell me what this guy's name is and I will make a little plaque that has his new name that you guys give him. Because Saber Jaws just isn't going to work for me. Also, I'll probably update uh, with some photographs after I paint the eyeball. But yeah, it was pretty cool. I like him a lot. If you guys enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, and all that jazz, stay tuned because I got more toy videos and more tech videos coming up soon. Uh, I even have some music instrument videos coming soon. Exciting!